Are you ready to embark on a life-changing journey of a transformative experiential learning opportunity that will not only transform your adventures and bucket list, but also shape the future of the planet and enhance climate action? Then let me introduce you to a study abroad program by North South Field Studies Safari, an international third party education provider headquartered in Australia. My name is Sylvia Amayo and I'm the project officer. Now we partner with eminent universities across Africa to offer field-based experiential learning. And in Kenya, we have partnered with um, leading public institution, Puan University, to offer a memorable academic safari to interested students open to all students from all over the world. Now, how will the experience look like? Imagine immersing yourself in experiences that expand your horizon, forming global partnerships with global peers, lifelong partnerships with global peers, getting first-hand lessons on climate change and um, human-wildlife interaction, while positioning you to formulate um, impactful environmental management strategies. All this, while enjoying Kenya's touristic sites, um, culture, ecosystem, breathtaking landscape, and wildlife. Um, why a study abroad program? Now, um, remember we live in a constantly evolving uh, world with shared global challenges. Now, this instigates an interconnectedness that uh, demands collective solutions. So embarking on a journey that helps you uh, see the impact of these challenges at local places and reflect on global solutions will help us uh, formulate uh, the required innovative answers. Now this program, that Beach to Bush, which I'll refer to as B2B, will traverse several regions, including the rolling savannas, lush rainforests, stunning coastal regions, and massive mangrove ecosystems. It will also cover uh, human wildlife conflict hotspots, uh, mega developments, and small scale fisheries. And you will get a first hand interaction with the big five, um, protected spaces, and local communities like the Maasai. Even better, Kenya hosts seven UNESCO World Heritage Sites. Now, this, like no other country, offers a rich tapestry of environments each teaching its own lesson on sustainability. You will study a first-hand industry and community-based um, initiatives uh, for adaptation and climate change, uh, including the blue and green carbon schemes, how local communities are coping with and adapting to climate change and sustainable development. Now, uh, why come to Kenya? First, at a country level, Kenya recently hosted the, U, um, the UN Framework Convention on Climate Change, Africa Climate Week, where uh, critical climate issues like green carbon decarbonization, net zero, and um, net zero, and many other climate issues were discussed, like climate financing. Now, uh, secondly, Kenya is one of the African countries on the receiving end of climate change impacts, with issues such as droughts, floods, and um, biodiversity decline significantly affecting her economic and social well-being. And to support this, our B2B program showcases key complementary SDGs, that is Sustainable Development Goals, uh, including 14 on life on water, 6 on poverty, and 13 on climate change, among others. So this means several international policies depend on countries like Kenya for their successful implementation. For example, uh, SDGs, the Paris Accord on Climate Change, and the Global Biodiversity Framework for achieving harmony between humans and wildlife by 2050. Uh, this makes Kenya a perfect model to study firsthand how developing countries are coping with and adapting to climate change as they chase um, economic development. Take the example of my current location, the Nairobi National Park. Now, in the background is a major Kenya's major infrastructure development, the railway passing through it, not to mention um, Nairobi National Park being under a flight path. You can hear the plane passing through. On the other side, there uh, is a five-star hotel and a motorway passing 
at the edge of um, the national park now this will give you um, a glimpse of today's environmental management and sustainability complexities and insight into uh, wildlife conservation conflict now such a setup begs the question whether the train the plane and the developments pollute or interfere with the inhabitants kenya is also known for um, lions breaking out of the park and roaming the highways now does this mean we blocked the wildlife migratory corridors and evoked human wildlife conflict now look at the dry riverbed on my left gives this this gives a lot of insight into human activities and economic development interference with natural resources and environmental flows leading to issues like dry um, like depleted water towers that dry the wildlife riverbed for example you can see there is a lion on my right which um, obviously depends on the water uh, watering hole on my left to survive when they are thirsty and um, you know uh, the other needs they have um, in terms of food and water a place like the Arboretum Forest where I am now is a perfect example for such lessons. Now the river behind me joins others downstream which traverse several regions into the Indian Ocean. Uh, at the edge of the forest there are major um, apartment developments and uh, at the, a few meters ahead outside the forest there is a coffee shop and a petrol station. Not to mention the occasional litter um, along the riverbank. Now such a phenomena will give you insight into um, the competition between the built and natural environments and other issues like um, economic development versus conservation conflicts, um, putting you at the forefront of being able to enact real life solutions. Now these are just a few of Kenya's distinctive heritage which will be your outdoor adventurous classroom backed by uh, academic content from high achieving professors who have taught, researched, published and led forums on uh, climate change conservation and sustainability uh, management. Now can you imagine how much adventure and immersive learning awaits? You will enjoy a one of a kind terrific six week that delves deep into sustainability uh, envi and environmental management studies um, that will mold you into um, into a thought leader who can uh, develop practical solutions in um, climate change mitigation, uh, climate risk management, and emissions um, reduction strategies, among uh, others. Now, um, here is the icing on the cake. The program comes with transferable credits which can be considered by your home institution for recognition of prior learning to fast track your education. So you see we don't just offer study abroad but an investment in your future and your education. Now if you are a university, imagine the opportunity for your institution. Uh, partnering with us will open doors to a diversified knowledge and education wealth, uh, widen your reach and strengthen your reputation. We'll also connect you to a region with uh, groundbreaking research opportunities and a wealth of expertise that will open doors to um, collaborative uh, research opportunities um, from a global perspective. So you see, whether you are a, an adventurous student seeking a transformative state-of-the-art uh, education that uh, lets you learn while ticking your bucket list and getting those extra credits, or a parent who wants beyond the ordinary for your child, or a university that is ready to make meaningful partnerships, research, and lasting impact, then our six-week uh, beach to bush study abroad program in Kenya is for you. Why? We are your gateway to adventures, uh, top-notch education, um, unmatchable memories and experiences, and um, an opportunity to engage in reflections and expand your eco-cultural worldview. So what are you waiting for? Um, let's change the world one student at a time, one partnership at a time. How? 
visit our website or contact us now to enroll and we will be waiting for you on the other side.